right, so the next one is acetaldehyde. Acet means to carbon, know that always. And then aldehyde is the aldehyde functional group. So now you know you have two carbons, but then one of the carbon has aldehyde group on it. So this is your acetaldehyde. Make sure you don't count additional two besides the aldehyde carbon. It's part of it. That's why it's called acetaldehyde. Okay, um, so the name would be ethanol because AL is the suffix that you get for aldehyde group. So it's ethanol. That's what it looks like. Make sure you always draw this hydrogen, which is the aldehyde hydrogen, because if you don't draw it, then um, you get points off for that. You have to show this hydrogen. Usually we don't show it on the line angle, but the aldehyde hydrogen, you have to show it. So to specify that it's aldehyde functional group. The Teaching Center, UF's Learning Resource Center.